three weeks since this corn on cornfield has been harvested. And we're out where we had done studies on stalk rolls for combine corn heads. And at 360, we designed a stalk roll called chain roll that comes in and it creates a seven inch piece. But it also creates every inch and a half a chaining where it holds it together and fractures and pierces. And the outcome will be it lets in the microbials to break this residue down faster. We know it takes five years for a corn plant this tall to go totally to be dissolved down to pocket change. And all we wanted to do at 360 is cut that in half and say, can we do it in two to two and a half years? And as I look from three weeks ago harvest at this piece, that's about seven inches long. And then you can see it's been fractured and you can see a tremendous amount of microbial activity on this stalk. We're well along to breaking this down. But what about other things that involved at harvest time? One of those is, can we create this environment versus say a chopping roll that creates these smaller pieces? And you can see here the pieces that they create. And then next spring, as we come back here at the planter, the challenge is, can the row cleaner clean that seeding environment where that seed trench is? If we let this small residue in, we're gonna have less plants. And so as you look behind me down this row, you can see the effect of that we showed that to you in V4 corn this year, we flagged this. And then 100 feet a row, we come in and we flagged exactly where plants were missing due to the seedling blight, due to the fact the planters struggled to clean that environment. Less plants, less yield. And so after two years of research, we're sitting in both years at about two bushel difference between a confetti roll and chain roll. So, we showed you almost eight years difference here in this 100 feet of row. But when we harvested the whole plot from all the way to the road, we ended up about a two bushel response. And I'll take that because I get really excited seeing how we're breaking this residue down. And I have total confidence next spring in here when we're seeding corn on corn, we're gonna clean that environment and get a really good plant sign.